Hey, what's up, guys? It's Let's Play part... I don't know even what part it is. It doesn't really matter. Um, part something of Mega Man X. Um, we just beat Flame Mammoth to fuck him up and get his weapons and shit. And all of the, uh... <coughs> all pickups is in this level. So now, it's time to fight Armored Armadillo. The, uh, pimpin' purple... Um, badass. I was trying to think of another alliteration, but I suck at words, so... Fuck it. This level's pretty neato. It, uh, it has some cool features. It's also the best level for filling up your sub-tanks if you just kill the guys at the beginning a bunch. Yeah, that was cool. You can actually do that without even shooting. I don't know how. I've never done it. Over here you get a, uh, sub-tank. And, uh, this thing it's best to kill it with fire. Because it dies pretty quick. And, uh, your reward is just two health things, which you don't really need, because the beginning of the level is really easy. This level, your fear is not really dying to, uh, getting hit a bunch, it's more or less to falling and dying that way. Uh, the enemies don't do very much damage, there's no mini-boss, and the boss himself is relatively easy, so... Well, he's hard if you don't have his weapon. I won't say he's easy. But if you if you if you don't have his weapon, he's pretty tough because he has a like a shield thing, and he'll it'll poop on you pretty much. So you kill it with fire, and what do we get? A heart tank. Yeah, we get a heart tank. Uh, also, this is one of my sister's favorite songs in the game. Um, it's one of those underrated songs. Like people don't usually mention it when they talk about Mega Man X uh, games and Mega Man game <coughs> Mega Man games in general. But uh, I mean, I agree with her. It's a pretty sweet song. And it really suits the mood of the level. Alright, so, mm, where I am right now is sort of the ultimate secret of the game. If you jump up here and then die, like, I don't know, five times after you have everything in the game, uh, you can come up here and get Ryu's Hadouken, which is actually, you know, quarter circle forward and uh, attack button, even. So it's pretty cool that they put that little thing in the game. X2 has the uh, Shoryuken. <clears throat> cool trick here is if you uh, release the your shot immediately, he'll actually get hit as he goes into his first little thing, and then, yeah, so now that you've hit him once, he has no armor, and he'll just kind of spam his shot, for the most part, which makes him really easy. See? Easy. Um, if you want a challenge, try killing him without the, uh, electricity, because he's actually one of the harder bosses if you do that, but, yeah. But the electricity, he's kind of a pansy little bitch, so, he kind of got fucked. Cool look. And, and you get to look yellow, like in a cool yellow outfit when you fight him, so, that's pretty fucking awesome, too. And then he gives you a pink outfit, which is totally, like, not, like, questionable. Just saying. I thought he was the blue bomber, if you know what I mean, like, well, not, you know, pink. Anyway, next up is, um, Lunch Octopus. For some reason, as a kid, I always thought it was Lunch Octopus. I don't know why. I guess I was just a kid and couldn't read very well. So, um, yeah, Lunch Octopus is next. Um, so, see you guys next time.